YouTube, this is Madcock83, and today I'm going to show you a new little feature with uh, the DNS's uh, new installer. Not really new, but uh, just a little new feature. Uh, right now I have the DNS Tech Pack Kumbaya Edition, version 101. Uh, that's the download you'll get right there. And once you open that up, you're going to take that folder right there, drag it on your desktop. I would advise reading the README, it's always important. Um, what you want to do is go ahead and open that up and uh, click, double click on that there. Um, see my other video, maybe I'll put a link up for uh, how to use this installer. I'm going to go over one of the new features. Uh, first thing I'm going to do is restore back to a clean 145, or you can just delete everything in your dot Minecraft and reload my, uh, relaunch Minecraft, and you'll get all the new stuff. Um, now if you hit install DNS you're going to get the pack. What I'm going to show you how to do is to get some of these extra mods. When you go here you're going to see a list of open source mods uh, and the mods that are included with granted permissions and down here at the very bottom is what I'm trying to show you. We're going to grab a few of these extra mods and I already have, I believe I have uh, one of the Optifines, some of the Team Fortress 2 stuff. Uh, Twilight Forest and Mistcraft. I've already downloaded those and these links right here will take you to those uh, those downloads and those are the links provided by the mod authors just so you know and there they all are sitting right there on my desktop. Uh, what you're going to do is before you launch it you're going to look in this folder that came with the download and you're going to see something that says extra mods. When you click on that just simply take, uh, let's see, Optifine is a jar mod so we're going to throw that in jar mods and then you have folder mods that's the this stuff will go to the mods folder you can just highlight all five of these that's all the team fortress centuries teleporters and dispensers along with miscraft and thomcraft uh, not thomcraft twilight forest just drop them in your folders right there see that's where they all went now when you launch the tech pack you will not see anything different but uh I can pull that out there, a little console. Just go ahead and click install mods. It's going to install the pack plus the extra stuff we just added. Uh, the configs, the pack already contains the configs for these mods, so there shouldn't be any issues with uh, conflicts. And now, if we click on our .minecraft folder, which I have a little shortcut for right there we click on our mods folder there's all the stuff the pack added and if we come down here you see Team Fortress, Centuries, and Teleporters got added along with Twilight Forest and Mistcraft somewhere I'm sure I'm staring at right there it also installed Optifine and we can try to uh, start up Minecraft real quick And there we go. We're launched up and looking good. If we uh, come to our options and go to video settings, we can see all the stuff that Optifine adds, so it got added as well. And uh, I could do super quick. I can use the pack, the installer, to restore back to a clean 145, like so. And if we look back in our dot Minecraft, you can see there's barely anything in it. Um, we can delete that. Delete all the stuff we added in there. I'm not sure you need to open or close that. I really don't know. Uh, now we'll just install the pack like normal without those extra mods in there just so I can show you guys that the pack doesn't install them automatically and if we open up our dot minecraft again and look at our mods come down here you see there's no team fortress there's no twilight forest and wherever miscraft should be which would be right in here it's not uh, whatever you add into that extra folder is what's going to get installed just wanted you to see that feature. This is Madcock83.